Okay guys, and welcome back to another video with me, oh, come again! Woohoo! So yeah, uh, I've gotten a few uh, questions about the newest version on Chrome and that some people are having troubles with uh, Unity games on uh, the newest Chrome version as of date, uh, which is the 15th of May 2015. So, this may get patched later or uh, fixed or something, I don't know, but it's not working at the moment. Uh, and I got a request from a friend of mine that I should do a tutorial on how to fix it so that you guys can uh, fix it yourself. I don't know why I'm holding a screwdriver. So, yeah, anyways, let's get on with the tutorial to fix Unity. So, yeah, okay. So now we're in a uh, game called Super Hard. It's a uh, new game that's currently in the development, and um, you uh, time basically only moves when you move. That's basically it. I'm not going to talk about the game, but uh, if you're going to try and play the game, we press play prototype, and you will see something like this: install Unity Web Player. So if you install this and click on it. You should see something like this, I agree, and finish. And then you try to update the page, and you still get, uh, get it. So Unity is broken in the latest version of Chrome. Now here's the way to fix it. Open a new page, type in Chrome, uh, and the two dots, I don't know what they're called, double slash, and flags enter and you should see something like this so as it says on the top here don't mess around too much with these it could break your chrome or lose your data and something like that but yeah what you want to look for is the enable NP API which if you scroll a little bit down you can see here enable NP API for Mac and Windows enables the use of NP API plugins you click enable on that and then you click relaunch just there you go and uh, we go into the game again and you see unity is now loading du -du 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 -du. So as you can see here on the URL, I'm still on the exact same page I was before I relaunched Chrome. Super hot. So yeah, now the game works, unlike the last time. So now you can play on Unity games again, on whatever page I just used uh, this game because I had it open. And uh, but yeah, it should work on pretty much all online game sites. So yeah, there you have it, guys. And uh, as you can see, Unity is now fully functioning, unlike before I enabled those settings. There you go. So yeah, and that's all there's to it. It's nothing more than that to enable Unity again. Just make sure you don't mess around too much with these uh, settings because you can, yeah, you can literally fuck up your Google Chrome in a bad way. You can lose all your browsing data, your passwords, uh, uh, your plugins, stuff like that. So don't mess around with that. But if you just click enable NP API like I did then you should be fine and you should be good to go on uh, uh, playing Unity games again. I haven't discovered any uh, problems with uh, enabling it again myself. You guys may experience some problems. If you do, let me know down in the comments and I will see if I can uh, do another tutorial on how to fix those if it's even possible or something like that. I can't promise anything but I'll do what I can to help you guys. So yeah. That's it for the tutorial on how to re-enable Unity on the newest version of Chrome. Yeah! Bye. 
So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like down below. And uh, as I mentioned, if you have any problems or if you appreciate this tutorial and want me to do more, don't forget to leave a comment where you state so. And if you haven't already done so, uh, subscribe to join the pack today. I do a lot of gaming collaboration videos with other YouTubers and I have also recently started doing some Let's Plays by myself. So yeah, there I have it guys. Don't forget, if you're all into that kind of kinky stuff, don't forget to follow me on Twitter and uh, follow me on Facebook and yeah, again, subscribe on YouTube. Woohoo! So yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and happy gaming!